Welcome to the beautiful Ontario Convention Center. And today we're here once again to see the Comic Con. And before we go inside, we're gonna check out the food trucks right in front of the Convention Center. It's always exciting to come here and see those really cool costumes, cosplay. Fat smash burger, that's where the Star Wars guys eat. And other superheroes. What, he's talking as well, look at this. And that's just here in front of the convention center. You don't really have to have a ticket to go inside. You can just walk around here and look at all the costumes from the outside. You never know what you're running into. But the good thing is that you don't have to wait in line when you got invited. So I'm just gonna wait for my friend to pick me up. What is the Ghostbuster doing outside here? That's another thing I never seen before that you can see all those beautiful cars outside. You don't have to pay to get in. And what always puts a smile on my face. Da -da, ta -da 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 -da. The DeLorean time machine is right here in the parking lot. And nobody's around looking at it. How can you not stop and look at this beautiful car here? This is the pole where the lightning got converted into the flux capacitor to go back to the future. I know. You've seen it many times in my videos, but there's always new people watching my videos, so I always want to show the DeLorean time machine. It's not Mr. Fusion. This is part one. Save the clock tower, save the clock tower. It's really hard to see inside. You've seen my Hollywood video with all the movie cars in it. Even the droids are coming here. That's a super family right here, look at this. We got Superman, Batman, Bumblebee. There's another Transformer car. And there we got the Pizza Planet truck from my friend. And look who's over there. It's there and everybody's sitting right there underneath the tent. And there's the Miami Vice Ferrari. A Ferrari convertible. See, I get to know all the owners here. They're all waiting right here looking at the car. Hi, you guys. Good to see you. Here's the man. Everybody's chilling out. Here's Mr. Hey. Miami Vice right here. Hey, hey back to the hey. future. How you doing? And look, there's Darren right here with his son. And of course, he's the one invited me again today to go to the Ontario Convention Center. I got to go on my knees for him. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Darren. That doesn't for... <laughs> sound right at all. <laughs> Edit it out. Edit it out. Uh, that's probably going to end up on the uh, editing, editing room. No, but... Uh, you know, it's actually a good position to get you guys in my video. Absolutely. So yeah. thanks a lot. Okay. And this Jurassic Park car is right over here. I'm a little grumpy today. I didn't get enough sleep, but this is always like something that makes me really happy to come here. I know you guys are probably tired of watching all the Comic-Con videos, but uh, I have How to do it. Tired. It's nice, it's right? Amazing. That's right. He's not getting tired. We all don't get tired. Yeah. And I always love to see those cars. Darren, this is not your Jeep. What happened to the Jeep today? I left it at home. I brought Taylor's car. This All is right. Taylor's ride. Yep, so it's mine. I mean, you've seen it. Taylor's car in the Christmas parade and the 4th of July already. So that's the one he's driving around. That's not the one I was in the parade. Uh, Got the front home. camera oh, here. Can I entertain an offer of... So they just done the interior. And how long did it take you to do, you said? Six months. Yeah, about that. Well, six months? Six months to a year, something like that. Yeah, so we tore the dashboard out. And then I didn't want to work on it for a while, but there was way too many wires and way too much stuff. When the dinosaur came around, you could see the ripples in the glass right here. Remember that? 
They put a TV screen in here and some other stuff. It's a little different from the movie. It's not exactly screen accurate, but it's close enough. But the good news is on 4th of July, I'm going to ride in his Jeep again in the 4th of July parade in Redondo Beach. No, no. What is it? Huntington Beach. Huntington Beach. Yes. Just like last time. <laughs> Just like last time. <laughs> All right. It's been so long that I watched the movie. I actually have to watch it again. Those are nice movie trucks here. So Clooney was driving this car right here in Dust Till Dawn, the Quentin Tarantino movie. And uh, it's always nice to run into the people. They get to know me now. Beautiful cars. And the like I said, legend. yeah, and this is my friend Daniel's car. He's not around right now, but I bet I'm gonna run into him today. Like I said, this is the Pizza Planet truck from the Toy Story. So I just talked to the owner and he told me that Justin Bieber was sitting in this chair and David Hasselhoff was here and they were doing like a commercial in this car. Yep, Justin Bieber and David Hasselhoff. Kid is talking to me. Well, Michael, since you don't wish to discuss that problem with me, I intend to continue to work with you during my decline. As you requested, I checked the police computers. The semi had been reported stolen, and neither the city nor the state had authorized any road crews. There's David Hasselhoff's signature. He was sitting in that car. Man, I was so happy when I was the first time at the Universal Studios. They had him displayed, and I took a whole bunch of pictures. There's Herbie full loaded. Welcome to the Comic-Con Revolution, right here in Ontario. Princess Leia just got a tote bag right here. Yeah. Well, that's what I call a gumball machine. Look at this. That's what you need in your apartment. You want to shake his hands. One, look at the hands he has, how big. Wow. Awesome costume. A lot of John Carpenter stuff here. Books, posters, and little knickknacks here. What is this? A uh, sea lion? UFO? I don't know those characters. Where are you guys from? A uh, little thing called X-Men. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, no, now that I now I see it. Okay. Sorry about that, but no, you guys look good. Yeah. <laughs> Duh. Like I said, I didn't get enough sleep, so of course I know. You got some pro wrestlers here, the honky tonk man. A lot of toys. That's Princess Peach. That's Princess Rosalie. <laughs> Man, you know your princesses, though. I know my my Nintendo characters. That's right. And look at the dress; is nice, huh? Where is Super Mario, though? It looks like some of the stuff is 3D printed. It's always something new. I've never seen those before. Somebody got a nice. Star Wars helmet. See, I don't think we have this in Germany. Fudge, cookie and cream, cotton candy, blueberry cheesecake. They're really good. Free samples, Mike. Yeah, Jump but right in. I don't think I can eat it. They're too sweet for me. Oh my goodness, they're super sweet. <laughs> yeah. It looks delicious though. They are. All the Star Wars figures. Man, I wish we had that when I was a kid. You can get your cards read right here. I just saw the movie Tara, the horror movie in the movie theater. It was pretty scary. From dusk till dawn. Jessica Rabbit. Those are really nice paintings. And wow. Man, look at this model. It looks so good. The Millennium Falcon. This is the guest area. Seems like it's pretty busy. Those are all the voice actors, comic book writers. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know any of them. All those big lines is for autographs.
And of course, Comic Con, you have to have comics, right? And those are all the really good ones. Look at this, $600, $500, wow. Maybe I still have some old ones in Germany. Lightsaber. Test the merchandise. Look at this. Shh. It makes noise too. This is actually nice. I would like to give a little show here, but there's too many people around. You can clash. Oh, wow, look how hard he's doing it. No, don't break it. <laughs> Got all different ones here. <laughs> like I said, why didn't we have stuff like this when I was a kid? You know. Now I'm 56 and I'm playing with a laser sword right here. Oh, look at this one here. Can you put that in one more time? Nice. And so what you can do is you can put this right through a belt or sash or something in your cosplay. And you walk around hands free. But you have a fully assembled lightsaber you can take out and challenge them very well. Yeah, and if you don't know, favorite. now you know. <laughs> oh, it scares you sometimes. What? Marlboro earrings? <laughs> well, it's not really hard to find them right here. Waldo. I really, really like this ET here. I always wanted to do a movie location from the movie, so that would be perfect having that one. There's Shucky. And that's over the top Sylvester Stallone, the arm wrestling movie. Another example, I had my whole room full of posts of Bruce Lee when I was a kid. What would I give to have this as a kid? What am I gonna do now? I was never really a wrestling fan. I know Hulk Hogan, but they got a lot of, and I know those two girls, I watched those. And then, of course, names like Ric Flair sounds familiar. Look who you got here, Rocky. I got some really good toys here. Is that Wanda Rousey? Yeah, she was in my store a few times in Venice. She actually used to live in Venice. My friend was really good friend with her. Seen her many times. Roddy Piper, Stan Lee, Predator. I like those. We never had like lunch boxes like this in Germany. Really cool. Hulk Hogan. Brandon Lee. It's good when people watch my channel, they actually let me walk behind and get a closer look. And he said that ET is not for sale. Bummer. They got all the Simpson characters here. Hulk Hogan, Smurfs. I have like 150 Smurfs in Germany. We got the Gremlins, what? That's the bad one. Good memories when we was fighting Rocky. Man, this is a super cool doll. Do we know those characters? I'm not sure. Yeah. Star Wars. Look how detailed this is. This is like one of those cheap toys. Those are really detailed, really good. Wow. Always let the Wookiee win. Look at those pillows. Those are all those anime characters. Konnichiwa, arigato. Those are nice. Wow. Hello. Is that Daisy? Man, we keep running into Valdo right here. Those are all the toys, toy guns, and foam and rubber. I had that one from Star Wars, but they're not plastic, they're like kind of foam. We know that gun for sure. 
I believe it's Harley Quinn's gun, if I remember correctly. I think so too. Those loving those swords. Woo. There's a lot of lightsabers here. Those are the 3D printers. Skeleton. All made of 3D print machines. Batman. Miss Spider Man. She's a wrestler. How do you actually call a woman wrestler? It's still a wrestler, right? A wrestler in. Got the Mandalorian here. Where's Grogu? All right, look, the mystery machine shoes. I've never seen those before. Nice. There we got Star Trek right next to Star Wars. There's the dude right here from the Big Lebowski. Nice. The dude, that's what you call me. That's right. Looking good in your PGs. Some lines are not as busy as others. But I like all those different costumes here. It never gets old to look around and see how people dress up. Oftentimes you see the same stuff at the Comic Cons, but once in a while you see some really cool artists. Look at this, Obama. And then you see something like this. That's actually Darth Maul's brother. I don't know which one is better looking. It's definitely a little bit mean in here. Ghostbusters are shopping around as well. Warning, the proton pack. Video show Fallout. Is that right? Uh, yeah. oh, uh, video game series. Yeah. Video game series. You always learn something new. Lots of Star Wars characters walking around though here. Steve Bloom, the voice of Wolverine, has the biggest line here. That's him right there. I don't know, voice actors, would I wait in line for a voice actor? Maybe for uh, Bart Simpson, the lady who does Bart Simpson. I like her voice. Hulk mania, the Hulk, he even do, got brother? the build. What you gonna do, brother? <laughs> nice. See, normally I would come here early in the morning, do my round, and then go back to the beach and work. I don't have to do that anymore. Now I can take my time and walk around and uh, look at everything. I don't have to rush. No more store. This is Doctor Who community. We got a Mercedes toy car for thirty-five dollars. That's the four x four truck from Back to the Future. All the Hot Wheels here. Fast and the Furious. And we got Harry Potter here, Hogwarts. And he's actually watching my videos, you said, right? Yeah. Now you're gonna be on it. Yeah, hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. <laughs> They're just chilling here. Oh, there's Harlequin. Really good looking Harlequin. The evil superhero from Homelander. There's Indiana Jones here. And check out Deadpool right here. Deadpool, but look what he's wearing. Crocs. What are those?
I've seen this artist before. I really like how he draws all those. Catwoman. Look at this Eva Knieva one. Nice. I'm actually get a print of this one right now and he's signing it for me. I appreciate it. Thank you, man. I've seen you, you in many shows right here. Thank so you. Next time you come down, check out his artwork right here. Yeah, I'm getting this one. For some reason, I really like it. And every time when I come to one of those cons, I got to stop by those. Even though I did not buy one yet, but maybe one of those days. Look at Pooh right here. I don't know why, but I really, really like that stuff here. Look at poor Woody missing an eye. I don't know what it is. It's like he just. You can never get enough Harley Quinn, right? Who is she texting? Wow, look at that makeup here. This is the only droid I'm seeing here today. Look at the sand speedster here from Star Wars. There's a picture opportunity. C3PO and R2D2. This huge bug here. What is that little one called? Chopper. All right, nice. Why she's not flying on that broom? Pika Pika Pikachu! Ah, Jack Sparrow is on the phone. I didn't know they had phones back then. Well, my friends, that was it. Live here from the Ontario Comic Con. I had to end the video right here. My favorite card, the DeLorean Time Machine. If you happen to like this video, give it a thumbs up. Push the notification bell and subscribe to the German in Venice. I know it was another Comic Con, but I loved it. I'll see you guys later. Tschüssing.